Hey, this is the Delta Bombers, and these are our Dream Tour lineups. For me, I would pick The Clash, number one. They're the architects of punk, in my opinion. Sex Pistols are a piece of shit. They are terrible. They're put together like a boy band. Forget them. The Clash actually made a difference. They made it happen. That's what I want to see. Along those same lines, I would want to put Refused on that tour as well. Refused are a band from the 90s hardcore screamo kind of band that are still touring around today. They made an impact uh, on me hugely. They taught me that you can do anything with music. They mix techno and jazz and punk and all that kind of stuff. Those two bands together would be incredible. I'd love to see that. Um, if I had to put a whole tour together, I would have to say <clears throat> I would really want Muddy Waters as a headline and then have the Rolling Stones and then with the Delta Bombers <laughs> in there somewhere <laughs> mixed in there probably for like 20 minutes intro and that's it and so I could watch the rest of the show and um, but yeah I would say something along those lines with uh, uh, then maybe fucking Elvis come out afterwards and shit come out and say that'd be cool I'm just a big fan of all of it all mixed together put that in one big pile and watch that wood burn that's what I like all right, so for my dream tour, opening the show would be Led Zeppelin, but with a 45 minute set. But you know why? Because it'd be fucking hilarious to see to try to have them decide what songs are gonna play and what songs are not gonna play on a 45 minute set, right? And then next up, for historical purposes, it would have to be Robert Johnson because nobody's actually ever seen him play. There's no video footage, there's only a few recordings. That would be awesome, right? And then finally closing out the show would be the motherfucking Doors because nobody did it like the Doors and Jim Morrison ever. I don't care who it is. And yeah, that's, that's it. It's an easy decision for me. I would say uh, for my dream tour lineup, uh, I would say maybe opening up would probably be uh, Richie Valens. I mean, I uh, just want to witness that like young uh, star energy power that he had. And uh, obviously he was like a, one of the first Latinos in rock and roll too as well. And then uh, probably just uh, closing out the show headlining would probably be just Bo Diddley, you know, just he was just crazy and going against the grain and just doing some crazy stuff back then that I'd like to see.